Okay, so we are at Beacon. And um, it's a residential neighborhood, but I think this is just a, like a thoroughfare, like a thoroughfare um, street. And uh, here's the house. As I was saying, you know, it's nice. It's been painted on the outside. Looks really pretty from the curb. It's got a nice curb appeal. It does need a new roof. The roof is 2005 and I just think that you might have a harder time getting um, homeowners insurance with this roof. So if this is something that you'd be interested in, I would definitely negotiate a new roof for you or money off for a new roof um, or have one put on before you buy it. Um, so it looks like somebody kind of went through and spruced this place up. Uh, it looks like they went ahead and painted on the outside, did a lot of paint on the inside, spruced it up to sell it. This, uh, little front porch is nice. It's got recessed lighting. I was saying this door is pretty heavy duty. It's like extra wide. Um, and then walking in, you know, smells good, smells fresh. Looks like they did, you know, painting everywhere. Um, it's a big house. So when you walk in here, you've got this little, you know, archway here and it goes into front living room with a fireplace. It's got popcorn ceiling. Looks like it's been painted. Um, that has the exciting glass door that goes out to the front porch there. Um, and then you come over here, there's the kitchen. It has a pocket door, so you can close that off if you wanted. And then this area here, which would probably be your dining room, has a light here. And then there's a wall here and it kind of goes over into another little area, which would probably be like a sunroom sitting area. Um, it's really pretty outside. These are not sliders. These are windows. And so lots of light. I don't even have any lights on in here and, and it's got a lot of natural light. Um, the carpet is nice. The walls are nice. And then here through the, you know, if I'm coming back here, this is where, you know, I'm inside the kitchen here, um, dining room area. And then this door goes out to the two car garage, which has been painted and the floor has been painted. This is definitely an older door. Um, you know, it, it looks like there has been some repairs here and there. I don't know, you know, there's definitely been a repair here been some sort of repair here. Actually, it looks like there was a door there at one time. So that's interesting. <clears throat> um, and then if you go into the kitchen, kitchen's a little small. Um, it has this, which is nice, so pantry. Yeah, this is like newer cabinets. This looks like stone, but it is not. It's like just a countertop that looks like it. Um, probably just like one of those in an inexpensive countertops that's just like a laminate over wood. Um, looks like they've got the newer appliances though. In the pantry here. And then over here, it's like another living room. And it's funny because uh, like we had just said, uh, they had wood paneling here and they went ahead and painted over the wood paneling. But honestly, it looks like it's just been... Uh, Kills like it looks like it could use another coat of paint. 
to make it a little bit, it's just too flat. Like it should at least have like a semi-gloss. And then uh, it's got some recessed lighting here. Looks like there was some sort of repair done here. Um, big broom, I mean, this is huge. And then this little area to sit at and look out to the pool, which is nice. Right this way is the uh, washer and dryer area. And then a door that goes out, it's an electrical panel in here. Beautiful view out this way. So you could just see here, there's the next door neighbor. There is no lanai. So this is just open. It's a little bar there. Uh, I like that it already has the fence for um, safety. The pool looks good. You know, from looks, of course, you never know with pools, right? So, uh, you know, this is the sliding glass door out from the, this big living room. And then there's like this decking here. I see there's probably spots that you want to put that spray foam in. It's never uh, a bad idea to make sure all holes are screened up or closed up so you don't get any critters inside. I do see these ants want to go somewhere. back out to the front door so you know you've got this front living room and all of that area and then you've got this back living room and all of this area and down this way there's like a mirrored closet oh has the HVAC in there water heater and here they put two separate vanities so you have a double sink and bathtub um i'm just feeling like it's a little janky you know it looks nice just something about it feels a little maybe the doors i'm not sure the windows are definitely older just, I'm just pointing out stuff just because I think that, you know, it's important for you to know what I'm seeing. Now they've got these older doors, these real old metal doors. And then here's the master. They did not redo those. So there's a sink. I mean, those could get painted white. So sink in here with the toilet and the shower. And then a sink out here. And then a door that goes outside. Pocket door to close that off. And then pretty nice big master. Nice view out the master window. So this isn't a split floor plan. This is the bedrooms all on one side here. Um, here's another bedroom with a window that goes out to the front. Nice size. Lots of 
deposits. And then the other bedroom. Three bedroom, two bath. Like this. It just it's not gonna roll out very good. This one looks like it was painted in. I think it's mainly the doors that I'm feeling are, if you had new doors, it wouldn't feel as janky. <laughs> All right, well, that's my narration of Beacon, and I'm going to go to Walton.